like I said, I got a lot less overhead than Sonny. And as you know, that savings goes right into your pocket. This is Sonny Corinthos we're talking about. Yeah, it's the same Sonny Corinthos who's on trial for murder. The same Sonny Corinthos who's gonna spend the rest of his life in prison who's not even thinking about business right now. Let me ask you something. When was the last time Sonny moved one of your shipments? Right, that's what I thought. In this economy, you can't afford to sit on dead weight, huh? I'll tell you what, you look scared, and I can go outside and find three dozen people who are ready to do business with me. So, I'll tell you what, give me a call in a few months, huh? Say, August? August? Yeah, maybe something will open up by then. I can't wait till August. Oh. I'll work with you. Huh. Good to hear. Hey. Hey. Sorry. Looks like I'm interrupting. No, no, Eddie was uh, just on his way out, right, Eddie? Mr. Zakara? Uh -huh. So who is that? Or do I not even want to know? That is Eddie, the pizza delivery guy. The pizza delivery guy? Uh -huh. uh, well, I hope Eddie brought a little something with a lot of extra cheese, because all I want to do right now is celebrate. Yeah, well, it's the occasion. I got my son back. I'm gonna go sit with Christina, but I don't wanna crowd her. Yeah, her mother and sisters are with her. Kiefer's dead. Hit and run. I just went and I didn't think things could get any worse for her. I'm probably wasting my breath here, but I don't know. How do you do what you do? What do you mean? Well, you've seen what Sonny does to his kids' lives. I mean, Michael's a mess. His guilt, his anger, Christina's not much better. Morgan's a good kid, but it seems like he's living on borrowed time, too. You care about those kids. I've seen it with my own eyes. And I get that you're being loyal to Sonny. What do you, what do you know about loyalty? These are my brothers and my sister we're talking about here, and I want them to have a better life than me. Yes, sir, now. why? Okay, well, then why don't you put aside your hatred you have for me and hear what I'm saying. Protecting Sonny does not protect his kids. It's just the opposite. I thought I was being followed. All right. Really? Are you serious? Yeah, I mean, I can't be certain about it. I, mean, I, I thought I saw headlights. Well, you probably were. You grabbed this. Well, are you just flying by the seat of your pants here, or are you telling him the truth? Because he's only trying to help. Look, I'm not making this up, all right? I, but I, I can't tell Lucky about the fence, man. Uh, no, I, I, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't exactly. tell him that, you know. Yeah. It was Mac. Uh, Kiefer's parents, Warren and Melinda Bauer, are screaming for an arrest. Well, let him scream. Unless the kid came too long enough to ID him as the driver, they got no case. No, that's the thing. Kiefer didn't come to at all. He's dead. So, this just became a homicide. My son was a 4.0 student, and he was a star athlete bound for Harvard. And he was a light, not only in our lives, but in the lives of anyone who knew him. Kiefer spent some of the last moments of his life lying injured in the dark on a deserted roadside. And somebody knew, somebody knew exactly where Kiefer was, the person that ran him down with their car and left him there <clears throat> to die. I'm offering $5 million for any information that leads to the arrest and conviction of Kiefer's murderer. Oh, I'm sorry. I your name. You must not have heard me. Are you okay? No. Well, that's understandable. Alexis, if you're up to it, I still need to take your statement. Can you tell me everything that happened tonight? A boy I liked and encouraged to date my daughter was secretly abusing her. And now he's dead. And I'm the one who... 
You're the one who won. 